I think when I'm in the garden, what I see so much is symmetry and sort of perfect lines and shapes that you cannot really recreate freehand because they're so precise. I can look at like a leaf shape and think, wow, that's better than I could ever do it, but I want to try. I'm Katherine Watson. We're in Portland, Maine, and I am an artist, a printmaker. Now I can't remember what else I do. Watercolor painting, watercolor comma painting, drawing, letterpress, is that everything? With printmaking, there's so many steps in the process that there's so many places where it could just vary a little bit from what you were planning. You have to give up some control. You are surrendering to the linoleum and the ink and the paper and all of these different materials. And there's this sort of reveal moment that you couldn't plan ahead for, even though you try. I think part of not making mistakes is redefining what a mistake is. If something doesn't come out exactly as you want it to, the only thing you can do is think of how to incorporate that into the piece. You're gonna heavily edit this, right? Uh, here we go, take two. There's that crumbling aspect to a block that you're using over and over again, where it starts to degrade over time and it starts to develop a little bit of that sort of antique quality to it. That sort of interaction between old and new is sort of the feeling that I want to capture. The heirloom quality, something that you can tell has been loved for a long time or has a story on its own. I've worked with Minted almost as long as I've been running my business, so they've developed side by side and always sort of played off each other in a way. Having that connection to another brand kept new ideas coming and new formats coming, more trial and error and more experimentation. That gives me confidence to do something that's a little bit different, and that's really exciting.